Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Vidya Jyoti, Emirates Prof. Arjuna Aluvihare. Why did I ask them to mention the cattle? Partly because it was a survival maneuver. And I think to have to use different things outside the box is fair to mention, especially in the week in which Steve Jobs, who was a completely out of the box person, has passed away. My computer recently fell in. And of course I had to open it. It's a laptop by the way. By the way, you can give me an IBM laptop tonight if you want. <laughs> and it has fallen in again. So they opened this thing to look at it. You know the most amazing is there are square things, tubes, pipes, fans, the most disparate array of things which you could possibly not imagine working together to produce a functioning laptop. Our plate was removed today by someone who was even better than the dinner. Anyway, I had reason to compliment her on the excellence of the buffet. But the buffet also was a mix of a whole lot of different things. Now, if at the buffet we were only given large quantities of one of those things, we would have left dissatisfied. So we had a mix. Now, I am a surgeon. Now, I don't want to describe to you in great detail what I see if I open an abdomen from top to bottom. Because you will find your dinner in those rooms there. <laughs> However, when we do open the abdomen, for one thing, once the abdomen is open, we can't tell whether the one is white, black, green, brown, orange, or anything about where they came from. Well, we can of course tell what they had at dinner. further, <laughs> but that's about it. And that thing has got a variety of things. Brown things, triangular things, comma-shaped things, tubes of various sizes, and if you open them, some have water, they have different smells. Uh, I have never actually tasted anything. <laughs> but again, very disparate. And you cannot imagine how this disparate bunch of things can possibly work together. I live in Sri Lanka. And I am surrounded by people of all kinds of different beliefs, mixtures, colors, ages religions, races, genetic patterns, and God knows what else. And they all have to survive in that island next to each other. I joined in the first JVP insurrection. And I, this is not the time to describe various incidents about the drive up to Kandy. When I was Vice Chancellor in 88, 89, and we did chairman, 89 to we were in the middle of the second JVP insurrection. And then we had the LTT situation spanning all that time and ending, probably ending relatively recently. We have grandchildren in the country, six of them. They are fertile and hopefully they will produce children, who will be of course our great grandchildren in Europe. Now, I think like the buffet, like the inside of the tummy, the variety and the, all that lot contribute and have to contribute to the strength of the country rather than its weakness. Now, my request to you, because we are all from a university which is full and of diversity and enriched by the diversity it has, my request of you in Perth is without waiting for another tsunami, try and think and invent the maximum possible number of occasions where all the disparate Sri Lankans in this town can get together and find that they have common ground, even if only to agree that the buffet was excellent. If you can do that in this town, 
and the information that that has happened in this town, which I am not sure if it is part of Australia, but I think politically it is part of Australia. Although you are not this. If the news gets back to Sri Lanka that you have managed to do that kind of thing in this town from our university, I think that can only have the most positive and beneficial effect for the future of our country. Thank you very much indeed for allowing me to come here.